Hello everybody and welcome to this video. First of all, I just want to thank everyone that's been subscribing to the channel recently. It's um, It's been a nice little pick me up. I think I'm on like 467 subs now. So I've, I've been getting like a lot of new supporters recently. And again, I properly appreciate that. Love to see it. Another thing as well, my year abroad to Berlin has been cancelled now. So there's no DOS off in Germany for a year. It's going back to Sheffield to finish my degree. So... Uh, on the positive side for you lot, there's going to be hobby updates over the next year. It's not going to be a year of more or less total signers for me. On the negative side, I'm missing out on going to Berlin. But you know what? There's a lot of uh, there's a a lot of worse things going on in the world. Worse things could happen to you. So um, it is what it is. <laughs> it, it, it is what it is. Anyway, in terms of hobby, I've been cracking on with a fair bit. Um, I've done this um, this new section for the. The Nazionale de Fox anime, um, the East Germans, um, a, few, a couple of new sculpts in here. I'm not going to bore you with the history again. I've already kind of done that, uh, but I'll, I'll just quickly go over them. So this is a kind of radio operator who I'm using as the, the sergeant. Um, he's a nice little sculpt him. Nothing too exciting, but you know what? It's nice to have a canvas cover on the hat. We have a guy with an RPG who's running this time rather than firing it. I really like this pose. It's got a fair bit of like dyna dynamism, a bit of movement. Um, I think he's quite cool running forward. Got a guy here who's kind of peeking around the corner, being a bit of a nosy parker. So there's him as well. Guy just kind of advancing forward, you know, a basic pose, but you know, you got to have him. I feel like it's quite a nice one. You might notice as well the strict tan, the um, the kind of little uh, little lines going up and down the uniform are a little bit neater this time. And um, I've got some new brushes, so um, that's really helped to pick out the details and stuff. Um, it's taken much longer to paint, right? It's taken a few hours to to get these done. Um, but it's worth it. You know, I, I like putting the energy into things I'm passionate about. And the East Germans is some of... Um, um, I really enjoy painting. And I really enjoy the end result as well. I think it's... I think they turn out quite nice. Um, if I do say so, me sen. And then the last guy there who you haven't seen is this, um, this guy who's kind of lunging forward a bit. Proper getting into his stride. He's running towards... The, the Rhine, you know, you've got seven days, you've got to make it quick. So that's in terms of um, um, in terms of hobby hobby update. I'm going to put that in um, the BMP there, just as a bit of a scale, so you can see how they kind of measure up and just how cramped the BMP would have actually been. Um, it's really interesting to hear all your guys' comments about um, your experiences in like the 90s and stuff um, as the wall fell and all you guys that are in the army. Um, interacting with like the Romanians and that kind of thing and your experiences with this kind of stuff because obviously I was born in 2000 I'm but a child um, so this is this is history for me but this was actually your guys present so that's really interesting to think about but also really weird as well and I imagine it's probably weird for you thinking that I wasn't alive during this uh, but you know what it is what it is and then also I've been working on a few Bundeswehr as well I don't have them all here yet um, I'm still waiting for the support teams to come so I've only got five riflemen, but they're painted up now. I won't go too in-depth because they'll get their own update. Um, but yeah, I've been working on them. A nice, simple kind of scheme. It doesn't take too long to do. Um, it only takes about an hour and a half to paint up a Bundeswehr soldier, where it takes about three hours or something to do um, an East German. Um, because I don't have this silly camo pattern, which I've decided to do on them. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with them. I think um, the project's coming on really well. It's nice to actually get something done quite quickly. Um, rather than taking like three years to paint a finale. Anyway, I'm going to keep this update short because I've been doing a lot of kind of longer updates recently and I don't want to bore you. So, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.